Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving, guys. Um, Ricky, what are you most thankful for this year? Nintendo. That's Nintendo. a good call. I'd say for me, Super Nintendo and you guys that have subscribed to our channel. It is doing great, by the way. We love you guys. Um, we haven't gotten to Swap yet. We're going tomorrow, and um, we don't know where we're going yet. We'll find out. It's supposed to rain. Hopefully it doesn't. Um, you'll know soon, because we'll roll some footage after this, but for now, Ricky, tell them what you got. Well, my uncle found out that we were doing all this retro collecting and stuff, so he sent me a bag full of his old retro games. I haven't opened it yet, just kind of wanted to... I've been waiting for a week to open this thing. Yeah, so. it's been driving us nuts knowing we have it, so... So we want to catch it on film. Let's Here we go. Let's see. Oh, I didn't want to look. Alright, to start it off, got us some Tecmo Bowl. Tecmo Bowl, awesome! Dude, awesome. I am terrible, terrible at this game. Every pass that I throw is a for sure interception. Dude, when I was a kid, dude, favorite football game of all time. Yeah, first football game that I think uh, had the rights dude. to put real team names on it. Memorable a slap. Oh, yeah, just. Yeah, it was good. Awesome. Oh, man, I think this was actually mine. Wow. Kid, Kid Nicky. Nicky. That's a fun game. Oh, I remember being awesome. fun. Awesome game. You have like the little spinning thing you throw it out. Dude, these are like all metal games. Yeah. I keep peeking in there. Sky Shark. No, I have never played Sky Shark, have you? No, I got it. I've never played it. If you guys have played Sky Shark, leave yeah. us a comment. Let us know if it's good or not. Yeah. I've seen the cover before. It's kind of a cool cover art. Actually, it's pretty intense. I'm going to put up a picture of this for <laughs> sure on the bottom of the screen. The guy in this picture is literally looks like he's squeezing out a big dump right now. <sighs> oh, no way! Aaron, you've got to talk about this one. Adventure Island. Adventure Island freaking rules. Oh yeah, God. Hudson Soft. Um, it's the only game I know where you can skateboard in the middle of, on top of dirt. So, it's a rad game too. Good job. Pretty fun. Good job, Uncle. Dude, Ninja Gaiden, come on. Or Gaiden. Gaiden. I don't know. There's a lot of controversy. That is an awesome game. I don't even think we need to talk about that really. Oh, Everybody yeah. knows. Everyone has had to play this game when they were a child. And how hard it is. Yeah. yeah. A lot of stuff. Dude. Oh, straight up Mike Tyson. Mike punch Tyson's out. punch out. Not punch out. Another game we don't need to talk about because everybody knows that game rips. Awesome. That's my childhood right there. Super yeah. Nintendo Ball, all right. It's a little broken, but hey, probably still works. The price was right. Yes. Oh, dude. Okay. <laughs> Bible Adventures. I love this game. You can be Noah and stack like six animals on top of you and just chuck the animals into the ark. Pretty rad. I don't know if I learned anything about the Bible from playing it, but it was pretty fun. Dude. Awesome so far. Straight up. Straight up Ninja Turtles. Ninja Turtles. Good game, hard game. Under awesome water game. under uh, water level on this game is ridiculous going through the seaweed, but it's a fun game. Oh, awesome. Sweet, this one actually came out good. Yeah, that looks really good. Heavy great. barrel. I actually heard this was pretty sweet. Never played it. Yeah, I never dove into it too much, but a little bit, so. Let us know. Yes. It looks sweet though. Yeah, it looks nice. The cover up's good on it. Oh, another one. All right, dude. dude. Another Metroid. Metroid. My third Metroid. Awesome. Dude. Yeah, you never go wrong with these. Yeah. Everything's awesome. I swear these are my old games. Rad Racer. Rad Racer. I don't you know why. just bought that last time, right? Did you? No, you didn't. Never mind. I got both. Good call, dude. This one I did get last time. Classic. Straight up Tetris. Well, it's not the tension Tetris, which would be nice, because you would a lot more money, but this is still good. <laughs> karate Champ. Yeah, Karate Champ. I played that. It's not that good, but it's a cool game. It's, it's no Kung Fu. Yeah, it's no Kung Fu, that's for sure. But it's fun. Data East, same company that made bad dudes and other fun games. Contra. 
two super contra. Super contra, right on, dude. Oh, awesome, man. Dude. Good for you. Ooh, this is like a one childhood right here. Oh, RBA <laughs> baseball. I saw a tension and I'm like, yeah, it's tension Tetris. <laughs> RBA baseball is still pretty darn fun. Yeah, anything Nintendo sports. Old NES sports games are pretty cool because they're not trying to get you to do upgrades like all the new games just to get like a new roster or something. We just yeah. game simple and easy and fun. Seriously. Let's see. He sent me a zapper. The gray zapper. Nice. Oh, you got the orange one. It's a sweet zap. Controller. Controller. NES. Let's see. That. We might be out. I think that's oh, it. Oh, another controller on the side. That's it. That's it. That was awesome. Seriously. Good job, Uncle Ricky's uncle. Uncle Rico, we're gonna call him. We'll call him Uncle Rico for now. But um, we'll see you guys in a little bit. Let's see how our, our uh, episode goes today. See ya! Seriously, where the heck is this swap me? Looks like it just got done raining, too. There's like 10 cars here. Seriously, where do I go? Do any idea? It's not in there? That's where the indoor one is, I think. They might have changed it to the indoor, but uh, that doesn't even make sense because there's no one here. I know the ATM is there, though. There it is! The ATM. Alright, whatever. We'll keep looking. How much for just the controller? Oh, everything's winning. Oh, come on, just the controller. Yes, he can. He can't, sure? Ricky. Yeah. <laughs> All right, man. You try. It's nice and wet, too. I was trying to help him out. I don't think they understand the wet Friday or wet Saturdays. What? We're here with Retro Hungry, by the way. What up? Yeah, randomly ran into him again. <laughs> he says it's been picked through today, but... We might, we might find something. We'll give it a shot. I kind of like this one. Yeah, it's Black Box series. Gunsmoke is an awesome game by Capcom. Dude, that one's... It's, it's like a Contra, really, but like up, up you. The up view stages, yeah. It's a really fun game. Obviously, Super Mario 3 and Super Mario 2. Um, we'll see if I'll work with her. See if she rolls with me. There it is. Let's see. Dun dun dun. Wow. Things you got games. Got games? And... I don't know if this is the original color for it. Change it. Yeah. The box looks. The color is more a little gray. What's this? Envelopes. Envelopes. Huh? Too. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> All right, guys, we just finished at Cyprus swap meet, so now we're heading to another swap meet. Aaron, how'd you do? Okay. Not that great. We ran into Retro Hungry, so that was cool. Got to hang out with a buddy. But, um, not too bad. We spent like 15 bucks or something. Got some goodies. We'll show you later. Nice. Thing is awesome. It's like Speed Racer's car. Oh my God. Look at this. <laughs> How much are the games? Five dollars each. Five dollars each. Metroid. Yep. Metroid Prime. Mario Doll. No scrap. Good deal. Yeah, they look good.
guys. We're on our way to a buddy's house right now. Uh, he has a bunch of games that he sells and he also collects. He does a little bit of both. We're going to check out to see what he has. We're driving and it's dark right now. It's kind of late. Raining. Um, it's raining. And we are by South Coast Plaza oh. because we're rich, <laughs> greedy men. No, we're not. We're not rich. We're honestly freaking poor. Yeah. It's pretty pathetic. <laughs> we are leaving our friend's house right now. And we did pick up one thing. He had a ton of good stuff. I'm talking a ton of good stuff. But so much good Like stuff. I said, we're poor. But uh, Ricky, show him. Yes. The mini Super Nintendo for 10 bucks. Yeah, we got it for 10 bucks. That was really cool of him. Um, he bought it for 10 bucks, and he said that he would sell it to us for $10 because he's a cool dude. Seriously. So, um, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Hello, guys. So, Welcome back. Aaron and Ricky here with the NES Pursuit again. Um, first off, I wanted to tell you guys Happy Thanksgiving again. But um, in the comments below, I would actually like it if you guys left us some comments on to what games you guys are most thankful for. Um, I don't know what game I would even say. I don't know. We don't have to answer that yet. I haven't thought about it. Um, we're going to cut it kind of short uh, right now because um, we spent a lot of time unboxing earlier, so we don't want to spend too much time. But we did get a couple games. Ricky, go ahead and uh, show them what you got. All right. Well, this time I got me some Wrecking Crew. Wrecking Crew is a cool black box series game. I, didn't, I haven't gotten to try it, but hopefully it'll be lots of fun. Then I got Donkey Kong Classics, which has the Donkey Kong and Donkey Kong Jr. Not Donkey Kong 3. No. And then, I like that with this nice little Resident Evil, what was this, the Premium Edition. It's missing a CD, but... Dude, just that thing's awesome, little... the box is nice, and that's, I think we both can agree, and probably a lot of you would agree that's the best Resident Evil the ever best. put out. If you guys haven't tried it, honestly, the best. Yeah, that's Seriously. right. Seriously. Good job. Luigi's Mansion, fun, been playing it ever since we got it. That game sucks. Get it? Ah! <laughs> Yeah, that was dumb. Okay, yeah, that's it for Ricky. Like I said, we didn't get too much on this time. Um, I got Crash Team Racing for a buck, which um, I never played it that much, but what I did play was pretty fun. I know it's not like a rare game or anything, but I had fun playing at the time I did. Yeah. Um, I ended up getting Gunsmoke, which I think I showed a little thing in the video for it, but um, that is a really, 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 really fun game. Yeah. Um, made by Capcom, so I guess you kind of figure that it would be good. Um, I also picked up Super Mario 3. I probably have another copy of this somewhere, but it's Super Mario 3. Some people regard it as the best Mario ever made. I don't know if I would agree to that or not. I don't know. I don't know. That's rough. Okay, but the last thing I got, and the final thing, is pretty awesome, as you saw in the video. Um, I picked up this bad boy, a Miracle Piano. Um, I got it for, I don't know if you can see it, I got it for... $12. The guy wanted 20 and I ended up um, actually talking him down right after our camera died. I was like, go figure. I did some good wheeling and dealing. And ooh, this fits nice right here. Um, yeah, so I got it for 10 bucks. And something else, or 12 bucks. The other thing that's cool about it is that Ricky actually has one too. So we are like probably hated by a lot of people for each having one. We both found it. We actually have seen three, but we didn't buy the. Um, the other one we saw like a month ago because I think the guy wanted a lot more for it. 20, but still anyone. 20 is still a good deal. I know, but <laughs> we did good for this. But um, that's it, you guys. We don't want to keep it too long, but um, we did want to say happy Thanksgiving again. And please remember to leave us a comment on what game you are most thankful for this year. And uh, we will take you guys out with a song. Until next time, see you then. Yeah? Where should we go next? Let's try the Goodwill.
are in Chino in a hidden area. Actually, it's not that hidden. It's uh, pretty early. There's a big line to get in, so me and Ricky are waiting outside right now. Ricky, mm -hmm. are you excited for today? Yippee. Yeah. Yeah, we're pretty stoked. We have all day today, so we're hopefully going to hit up two swap meets. We are excited, everybody. Super Nintendo Dirt, Dirt Trap FX. I've played that. Here's some more games right here. Check it out. Another Super Original Mario. Mario. Ooh, NBA Jam box. That's pretty rad. I can get the Mario just to have another Mario. Too. Can never have too many Mario's. Nope. That is a true statement, my friend. I don't know if anybody here has ever played Base Wars, but it is freaking awesome. Street Fighter 2010? What? You do? Really? Final Fantasy Echoes of Time. Holla! Let's hope he's cheap. Maybe. Marble Madness. You see anything? That's like a booklet. For a Game Boy means. Ooh, yeah. It's a cool booklet. Where's the Game Boy, though? Or the game? Did you see it in there? Uh-uh. Alright, Aaron. How you doing? Good. We were just about to leave like five minutes ago, and we only got like two games, but we just scored in the last like five minutes big time with this one guy. So, I'm pretty excited. <laughs> Now we're going to more swap meets. We got a full day ahead of us, finally. So we'll see. Cool. So now we're headed to Santa Fe Springs, which was closed last week when we went. So we are hopefully going to get lucky in yep. Kentucky. I have an itch under my nose. All right, we're going to uh, head there now. We're leaving Chino. You. Nikki Speedway is actually pretty fun. Off road challenge, also. So we are not finding anything here. Um, I'm kind of sort of starting to hate Santa Fe Springs Swami. It's nothing but stores, no garage sales. <sighs> As we walk by a reseller. <laughs> so we're leaving Santa Fe. I don't know. I'm kind of bummed. I don't want to dog on the Swami too much because we've only been here technically once. We tried to come last week, but it was closed because of the rain. But, um,. <laughs> Seriously, it was like all stands. It was, there were like stores. There was like, what do we see? Like four garage sale type places. Yeah. We can't complain. We got two pretty cool, ga pretty cool uh, Pokemon games that we'll show you guys later. But let's try another swap meet. Our third one this morning. Bad to the bone, super scope. We do not have this yet. We do need it. Sensor in it. Oh, it needs a sensor in it? Yeah. There's a Latin boxed for Genesis, where you do have a sword as opposed to the Super Nintendo version. What you holding, Ricky? Mouse. To the earth. To the earth. Boxed. Silent service. Silent service box. Another ultra game. Incrustellis. Some goodies. Not gonna lie, for a reseller, these guys are pretty good priced and pretty cool. Tiger Heli, which I loved as a kid, by Acclaim. Jordan versus Bird, one on one. 
It is not very fun one on one, but it's a game I do not have. Pretty decent X Men. Ooh. You're an X Men man? Yeah, I am. Well, let's see. How much are the uh, Nintendo games? Two dollars each? Alright, I shall. Will you do three for five? Alright, I do not have. Do you have bases loaded too? I'm not sure. I know we don't have this game, Othello. It sucks, but. Just a game to add? Yeah. I'm gonna do it. Sweet. Five bucks. Cool, it. Ricky's debating if he's gonna buy WWF Raw box for three bucks. Are you gonna do it, Ricky? I don't know, I'm gonna offer him two, see what happens. What do you guys think at home? Should he do it? I don't know. Ask him for two. Alright. Two? Yeah. Alright, take it, dude. I wanna get married to one of these dolls. Just kidding, that's sick and twisted. No case. Well, how much is it? This thing says three bucks. I think it's three fingers. Is this twelve or ten? Three bucks. I just reduced it. And I took the game out because it keeps stealing the game. <laughs> what do you think? Not the back case. I don't really care. I just only one more. Yeah, we don't have one yet. I'll, I'll, I'll three bucks is good. Okay. Yeah, can't, it's either way. It's sweet decor, as I always say. Are you, Are you the IRS? Yes, hello, yeah. You're under investigation. No, hey! Now I have to blur your finger out. No, I'm just kidding. You gotta blur everything. Yeah, we do a kid's show on ABC. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Ricky just got a Game Boy for three bucks. Do you want a little history on this, Ricky? This was made by uh, Sega in 2009, released for the Atari for the Mario 64. <laughs> yeah, dude, it's good stuff. Oh, are you serious? What was it, though? Silent Hill 2. It's oh. one of my all-time favorites. <laughs> if there's one thing better than video games, it's nothing. But food comes close. Ricky, did you have a good day today? Oh, yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, how many Dr. Wileys would you give today? Maybe 11. 11 Dr. Wileys out of 10? So all in all, we, um, we had a pretty good day out there, but um, we didn't get anything too rare or too expensive, but nice. we're happy about our boxed NES games and stuff, but it, it's really about the fun. Um, yeah. Going to the swap meets every weekend for us isn't always you know, going home being like, oh my gosh, I got the rarest game. or the, best pickup I ever got. It's just having fun. Um, yeah. We've been doing this for a long time together, so I'm... Ooh, and the Game Boy is a plus. Yes, the Game Boy is a plus. Hello, Hello friends. friends! What's up, you guys? Aaron and Ricky here again with the NES Pursuit. Yep. Um, we kind of spent a long time um, on that video, so we kind of got to go a little quicker than normal. But um, first things little. first, I did want to say thank you to a guy named Kingsley Blancher. Um, he sent us Contra Hardcore. Um, yeah. He texted me and, or actually uh, in YouTube, sent me a message saying, hey, is there anything you and Ricky really want? And I said, you know, Ricky's been wanting Contra Hardcore for a long time. Thanks, so, man. Um, he sent it to us. That's awesome yeah. of him. Um, he also sent us some Game Boy games for our kids. Um, he has a Facebook page called Houston Retro Gamers. I would check that out. It's a community of YouTubers who um, just share their games, what they have. They also do trades and stuff together. So um, it's good people. Um, yeah. Ricky, go ahead and show them what you got. Sorry, I feel like I'm rushing. All right, real quick. I got a Game Boy original. That was awesome. Mario the 3 Duck Hunt and uh, the World Track. Not Mario 3, if that's what you thought No, said. I'm sorry. <laughs> it sounded like you said Mario 3. I was like, really? Got me two games. Mega Man X Command Mission. Awesome. Ricky's a big Mega Man fan. It'll be awesome. Can't wait to try this one, too. Pokemon XD. Yes. And then, real fast, Bok Team Silent Service. And it looks like it was just like slit open at the top just to get the game out because it has like the seal seal on it otherwise. Yeah. But that's pretty cool. And then NBA Jam Tournament, Tournament Edition. Edition. That is like the funnest game, basketball game ever to this day. I still say it is the best, best basketball game He's ever. He's on made. fire! Yeah, it's amazing. Um, okay, well, I guess on that note, we'll jump into my basketball game. 
Jordan versus Burge. Extremely boring and crappy, but add it to the collection. Um, win, lose, or draw, and Othello. Um, I show them together because I don't think much of either of them. I just got them because I don't have them. Um, I got them for collection-wise. Um, Tiger Halley, which I do love. The music gets a little annoying after a while because it just repeats, but the game's pretty fun. It's good. Track and Field 2, which is funner than I thought. I put it in the other day and it was way funner than I thought. There's a lot of different events you can do. I really enjoyed the fencing. Um, I did. <laughs> Shut up. To the Earth. Um, it has everything in here. It has the casing. It has the instruction booklet. So I'm pretty excited about that one. The game's pretty fun. Nothing too awesome, but... Like I've mentioned before, we're both, uh, we fall in love with box games way too easy. Yeah. Speaking of that, I got Dirt Tracks FX for Ooh. Super Nintendo. Everything's in here too. It has those, like, Polygon Virtua, like, Virtua Fighter graphics, which kind of hard to steer and, and, uh, your motorcycles and stuff, but it was cool. And then I also did get Final Fantasy Echoes of Time. I also got Final Fantasy Advance, uh, Final Fantasy V Advance, but, um, I lost it at my house. Whoops. Which I'm really excited to play those, by the way, because I've never played Final Fantasies on handhelds yet. And last thing I got, uh, Nintendo Power. It's the October 2012 edition, which I know there's only two more following this. So, sadly. I don't know. Sadly, yes. Seriously, that is pretty sad. Um, that's it. I hope we didn't rush too much. We kind of <laughs> did. But yeah. we kind of had to. The video was like already 12 minutes long without Sorry, guys. Yeah, any of this. But um, until then, I guess that's it. Just stop hitting the wall.